Hi, this is Jay Oliver, and this is my Mo2 tip of the day. Using Digital Performer, I am a big fan of the trackball as opposed to the mouse, and here's why. I use a specific Kensington trackball that has this very cool ring uh, that is a scroll ring. And, and in doing so, you can scroll obviously up and down as you need to, but you can also scroll left and right by holding the shift key. And that is the way I navigate around the sequence editor window. The other thing is I've assigned uh, buttons to do different things. Specifically, if I want to zoom in, like here, to a WAV file, all right, let's say I want to zoom back out, I can zoom back out by hitting this button one at a time, zooms back out, the other button zooms back in without having to move my mouse anywhere or look up or do two-handed keystroke right here on my right hand at all times at any time I can instantly zoom in or zoom out.